Hi guys, welcome to my first YouTube video. It is your girl, Katie. I'm so excited to be doing this video right now. I don't know what's taking me so long, if I was just lazy, but we are nipping that in the bud for 2023. But yeah, if you have found this video by any chance, like, comment and subscribe, you know, show me some love, I will always show love back. And let's get into this video. As we all know, or may know, that Sephora is coming to the UK on the 8th of March. Guys, you don't even know, but you will find out in this video. I was actually headhunted by Sephora. I was fresh, just fresh back in the UK from being away for a while. It's like, what do I want to go into due to my background, jewellery, nails? Get you one of these lashes music etc but we will disclose that later but yeah and then this happened to come up so i went for it and i have been wowed every step of the way the kind of generosity this company has provided an amazing experience and i would highly recommend anybody going into a role with them just to sum up my experience so far i had two weeks brand training intense but it was amazing so grateful for the opportunity we were given so many goodies during our training and guys it was a lot we had skincare hair care and makeup i did also in fact receive some fragrancy show you one by one what we got for each day and at the end i will show you what i won okay so the first brand is glow recipe i absolutely love this brand it's the first time using it but I love the toner, I swear by it. I was given a toner, serum and moisturiser. Yet to use the moisturiser, but love the toner and absolutely love the serum. So the next brand I was gifted was Wishful by Huda. Um, again, guys, I haven't used any of the products yet, but I have been using a sample of the Yo Glow and that is amazing. It's an enzyme scrub. We got given some stuff from Inky List, uh, the oat cleansing balm, the caffeine eye cream, and the hyaluronic acid serum. Guys, I swear by this, these are in my everyday routine. I love the balm, I love the eye cream, I love the serum. These get used day and night. So here we have Medic A. I have been using the cleanser out of this, I believe. This is the CSA Retinol Edition, so it comes in a box, um, and I use the SPF daily. So Dermalogica is one of my favourite brands, I swear by them, especially their daily micro exfoliant. Um, I use that when my skin is really breaking out, but um, yeah, highly recommend it. So Cordially gifted me a foam cleanser, the Rich Cream, a glycolic acid corrector night cream, as well as a serum. And they also gifted me this instant detox mask. If you love a clay mask, this is great. I love, love, love Paula's Choice. So I was glad to see them at brand training. We received a bag of all these goodies you see on screen. The retinal treatment, the zelic acid um, treatment, as well as the exfoliant pill and the exfoliant. So we have the Fenty Skin Instant Reset. Um, I love this 
gel this is the gel texture especially in the winter due to the fact my skin is very dry in the winter i put this on in the night and in the morning my skin is glowing so guys i hadn't heard of this brand before brand training but i absolutely have fell in love with it simply because of their motto as well as um the colors i love colorful things and yeah they were so generous and they were lovely the women that came through at brand training so Supergoop was one of those products that I've heard about but wasn't able to find in the UK and we have it so I'm very grateful. I heard this is a very good sunscreen. I haven't used it yet but I heard it's really good especially for people that are of more darker skin tones as it doesn't leave a white cast. Guys, I'm not going to butcher this name but um, this is the Lemonade Smoothing Scrub. Um, I use this mainly on my body, so like anywhere where I have dark or high hyperpigmentation, such as the elbows, legs, um, I think it's great. So we have the Skin Fix, the Skin Barrier Gel Cream, and we have the Peptide Cream, one's gel and one's more of a thicker consistency. Guys, this is one of the only moisturizers i'm using right now i absolutely love the texture of both i interchange depending on the weather and how i'm feeling but this is my go-to as of right now guys when i tell you elemis was so generous like i couldn't even get all the products in one take but as you can see we've got the pro collagen cleansing balm the superfood midnight facial the glow moisturizer and the facial oil i'm so so grateful also from elemist we have the pro collagen marine cream the eye mask and the dynamic resurfacing facial pads absolutely love these okay so next we have hair care this is the jvn the instant recovery serum as well as the pre scalp oil um treatment so this is used before you wash your hair and then the serum would be after i have used these two and i can confirm that these two work great together leaves the hair very silky smooth um great products. so we have moroccan oil a brand i'm very familiar with from my days of being an apprentice we have the hydrating shampoo the hydrating conditioner a oil treatment a leave-in conditioning spray and they also gifted us a dry body oil which i absolutely love because it sprays out so here we have jisu i hope i've said that right yeah jisu um this brand i hadn't heard of before brand training but i can confirm i have used some stuff absolutely love it um we've got a conditioner hair mask shampoo a hair perfume and some hair oil. I absolutely love the concept of a hair perfume. So this is a big thumbs up from so me. So from Vegan More, we have a conditioner, a shampoo, and also a hair serum. Absolutely love this product. So next up is makeup. Um, this is Benefit. So I received a mascara, a eyebrow pencil, a eyebrow setter, and some cute mini sized um products very cute indeed so from hourglass we have a mascara a duo set with a primer and some translucent powder i also received a lipstick from them a red crimson lipstick so from milk i received the mattifying pore primer and two mascaras so here we have the Glass Bomb Cream Lipstick by Fenty Beauty, a Givenchy Lipstick, a YSL Mascara, a YSL Highlighter Stick, um, a, also another YSL Mascara, I believe. I have to say, guys, Huda Beauty is another generous brand. Um, I received a foundation, a cheek tint, a concealer, some translucent powder as well as some lashes this amazing palette guys this palette's colors are amazing um yeah so a mascara eyeliner lip liner and lipstick i was gifted 
by KVD, their eyeliner. And this is the Dazzle, Dazzle Stick. I can't lie, this colour, uh, it's a, a cream eyeshadow. It's a very nice iridescent colour. Okay, next we have Give. I think I'm saying it right. Give by Gwen Stefani. Um, absolutely love the mascara. Uh, it has a little ball at the end of the brush. Um, this is really good for getting those individual eyelashes. I received two lipsticks, an eyeliner and an eyeshadow palette. Absolutely love the red lip stain. Definitely a thumbs up from me. And last but not least, we have the brand Tarte. Um, I'm actually really excited to be using this brand because it wasn't available in the UK. But I got a lovely eye palette, two concealers and two foundations just because I am in between colours sometimes. Um, and eyeliner. Okay, so next we have Fragrancy. This is Burn Cherry by Kelly. Um, I absolutely love this smell. If you like Lost Cherry by Tom Ford, then you'll love this smell. I would say the dry down is a little bit more woody or earthy, would you want to say? Yeah, but um, definitely a new collection piece for me. So I was gifted another Kelly perfume. This is vanilla. This is great, like uh, I love stuff that has vanilla in it. I feel like vanilla goes with everything. It's good for layering, good for date night, just smelling sweet and feminine and everything nice. Yeah, I, um, I do recommend this. I know I say I recommend everything, but I really do recommend this, guys. And if I didn't, I would let you know, definitely. So this is Idol by Lancome, one of two Lancome perfumes i received uh this one i didn't particularly like i don't know what it was about it i couldn't really grasp what i was smelling again my perspective so i gifted this to my mother she completely loved it so it didn't go to waste we have another long come fragrancy this was sweet i like this one i do like some scents that are sweet not all the time and not overpowering, but this is nice. Uh, it could be nice to layer with something a little bit more, I would say, woody. Next, we have When the Rain Stops by Mason Mangella. Guys, I absolutely love Replica. Um, I love the concept and the emotions and the, the whole concept, what it evokes. So, yeah, I definitely am a big fan of these. But yeah, this is like a more earthy, very earthy, very fresh, literally, when the rain stops. So highly recommend if you like fresh, earthy smells. I was gifted this Jo Malone perfume. I believe this was the lime, mandarin and basil. A uh, very fresh, citrusy scent. Um, Not to my taste, as per se. So it was gifted to my mother. Here we have Paradox by Prada. Again, love this smell. It's a very floral smell, if you like floral smells. Um, good for everyday, you know, everyday use, straight out the shower. Definitely a thumbs up from me. Lodotti by Givenchy. Givenchy, whatever you want to say, is one of my favourites. I actually have a um, bottle that I was gifted for my birthday and when my mum saw this one, she went crazy. So I actually gifted it to her, but definitely a all-round perfume for me. Another favourite fragrancy of mine, Le Bre by YSL absolutely love this again all year round i also love the intense and the le parfum um if you are looking to get into these i highly recommend such a, a mature smell like a very date night ish or just around your man or you know your love interest highly recommended here we have another fragrancy from ysl this is black opal I can't remember what this one's called, but this is a very sweet, or sweeter scent to the original Opal. I would say the original Opal is quite a mature, 
oody woody smell as opposed to this it's quite fruity uh sweet so next we have one of two giorgio armani scents this is c passion um again this is a sweet scent uh lovely for summer absolutely love this scent in regards to the original scent this would be way sweeter um a bit more floral so the second um scent from giorgio armani is my way guys this one's growing on me it smells i from my perspective this smells like lychee and i absolutely love the smell of lychee um as you can see on the bo the box it's floral so it's quite a sweet but not too sweet not overbearing uh definitely a new one for me okay so next we have gucci and this is the flora um this one is definitely on the sweeter side I would use this as an everyday scent. It depends on what you like. I like this as something to layer um, on top of or underneath, um, either or. But yes, this is something you can use every day if you like that floral smell. So here we have Miss Dior by Christine Dior. This is a very clean floral scent with notes such as iris, peony, um, apricot, vanilla, lily of valley. So very fresh floral smell. Um, really nice for every day. The next three fragrances I was gifted were men's perfumes. I have Sauvage by Dior. Absolutely love this on a man. Um, will actually be gifting these to my boyfriend. So yeah. Um, yeah, again, love this scent on a man. It's just a very come here-ish. <laughs> so next we have Armani Code by Giorgio Armani. Um, I'll be honest, guys, I feel like men's perfume or men's cologne, they all smell the same. So not much to say on that, but I do like how it does mix with pheromones. So everyone gets an individual scent. Last but not least, guys, out of all the products I received, we have Gucci Guilty for men. Um, again, I feel like they smell all the same, but yeah. I did, in fact, receive some goodies after brand training just because some of the brands couldn't actually locate their products. But here we have some fresh stuff. Again, another very generous brand um got a few samples got a rose kit and some lip therapy uh treatments and then next we have olaplex um i've wanted to use this for a while so i'm very happy to see that i have it now so as i mentioned in the beginning i was gonna reveal to you guys what i ended up winning your girl won something me i want something i was just as shocked we happened to have brand training with dyson at the end of the training they were like and i already i already peeped i already peeped this bad boy these were on the table so everyone got gifted one of these well these two should i say and they were like if you have a mark on the back of your paddle brush you win a prize. Hold on. Your girl had the prize. Your girl. When I said, oh, me, I never win anything. And that's not to say I'm not blessed or lucky because I'm very abundant. But me? Like, me? For real? Oh my God. <laughs> Again. Like, I'm so honoured. So, I haven't really, tell it like, I have used this and I love a paddle brush, especially a good one. A good one, because I have very thick hair and this just does the job. Let's do a little unboxing, okay? Because actually, tell it like, I haven't actually um, opened the straighteners yet. So we have, this is amazing, like I said, I've already used it guys. 
know this is open, but I actually haven't um, taken it out yet. Dope, so. dope, dope, dope. Do. Now for this bad boy. Right, guys, we're gonna attempt to open this bad boy. So this one, actually, let me give you a little bit of information about it. So this one is the Dyson Core Corel. Corel, yeah. And I have a special gift edition. I don't even know if I'm saying that right, but I'm just gonna say blue and rose. Sometimes things don't come easy to me. <laughs> heat mat or travel bag, heat mat, but then this comes with, actually this is the travel bag. Why well, about to show you anyway? We're doing this together forever. Never. So, this is what it looks like. Mm -hmm. I take this out, I feel like it's not gonna get back in. So, we are just showing you first time. This is the first time we've seen it. It's cute. I work with it. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. I love this kind of blue. So, I am very happy with this color choice. Normally, I would like like monotone, but black, grays, white, you know. So I have been in mind, like, I've always known about Dyson's, but when it comes to, like, I knew about the hairdryer, I didn't know about the strainers and even the air wrap. Now your girl wants them all. Take this on as your carry-on when you're travelling, um, and they have a way to take the battery out, because I'm guessing it's lithium. This is the stand for it, I think. Oh, it is. Your girl knows. Okay. I guess we have the charger. Okay, so yeah, from what I know, you can have it cordless, plug it in, etc. This is so dope. Okay. Love this. I'm actually going to open the strainers. <laughs> They're so pretty. They're so pretty. These are so pretty. I absolutely love them. Let's see if it's got any charges. Well, I'm gonna show you what happened when I did it. So it came on, but it told me it was on airplane mode. Little thing at the back that you turn, because right now it's on airplane mode. So I'm guessing I'll have to undo that. Your girl has to cut down these nails before she can even do anything because I need to function. I'm so happy about these, I can't lie. I am very grateful. These alone are around 400, so to be gifted them amongst so many other things, like 5k worth of products. Okay guys, that concludes this video. My first YouTube video, I am overwhelmed because it's done now yeah there's going to be so much more content to come i'm just a creative all round, so just wait and see just make sure that you are liking commenting and subscribing tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend guys stay tuned and thank you so much for tuning in with me we're just trying to make it work Okay. No. I know that my eyelash is coming off. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm very obsessed on. I have I've been obsessed for a while. I told. I told people and they didn't believe me. But now I'm here. Now I'm here. <laughs>